Why are we keeping this nasty tomato all on my skin? I don't want to see it. No, no, no. Ride me no key. Best it ever best in me. Where would I be without you? You know you always give me through. Everybody, I'm T. I'm Coco. And together we are Black AF. <laughs> Waiter. Is you know that what we're serving? We're serving wow. your order. We Hi. are. Welcome to the Rena Kitchen. Have you I'm ever worked in like a food service situation in your entire life? I've never had a real job. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever played a character who was in food service at all? No, I have not. Never even like your character in a show had one episode in which she was a server. No, I have not had nothing. <laughs> Why have none of my characters been employed? Um, <laughs> there is a chef, Mr. Gordon Ramsay. He has this show, right? He has several shows. He's like the Steve Harvey of food. I think I, I know of I know of him because of this one meme. What? Where he took the bread and put it between the girl's ears. I think and he that, was like, what are you? Yes. And she was like, I'm an idiot sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Warren got Master Chef, Kitchen Nightmares, Hotel from Hell. Uh, uh, he got the YouTube one with the kids. channel, Master Chef Junior. Yes, but he's so nice to them kids. He most times. Most times he okay. really keeps it composed. If for them the kids. kids brought up uh, that snapper we made earlier, don't think it would go that well. If also, those kids would never make the snapper, snapper the way that we did it. I had Roxy look up a bunch of Gordon Ramsay recipes because Gordon be doing the most at all times, and we don't have time for that. None. So I said, please pick the most basic of Gordon recipes so that we can try this on the show. Were you successful in your endeavor? Look at her expression. I think so. The question mark on yeah. her forehead. No, I do, I do. Okay, <laughs> so here's here's the dish, okay? You're making a tomato soup with like a cheese bread. Okay. But, you know, cool. again, Gordon elevates things. So there's, you know, some little pizzazz. How are you going to elevate some bread and some soup? Gordon. No, Gordon likes to. Oh, it's Coco's favorite fruit. Look at it. Don't look. Come here, Coco. Look. It's your favorite friends. You know I ain't liked a tomato <laughs> in about 23 years. Right off the bat, I see dairy. And I really hope that the dairy does not need to be heated. Some salt. Yum. Coco, you're going to get high cholesterol. Girl, you were just sipping on an energy drink. Don't do me. <laughs> Y'all, what's worse, energy drink or salt? One thing that I've found that is interesting mm -hmm. is what it looks like when all the ingredients are right in front of you for a meal. You never mm. think about that when you're cooking. You're just like, ugh. True. Ugh, and that's what there, and the that's there. What the is that? Okay. Now, when you Give said Panera. Yeah, that's real bread. I was thinking Wonder Bread for me. <laughs> Okay, uh, I was definitely thinking, not artisan. You know, there was yeast involved in there that, There was maybe. some yeast that rose <laughs> in that bread? Should we rest up? Woo! Woo! Is it? Please, Woo! no! All right, nice. Not there's a back. Hate Every that time there's us. been a back to a recipe, we have failed before we got to the back. Ah. We failed early. Ah. I did want to bring you these tools. Oh. Okay, I know what that's for. Yeah. That's Guacamole. for. Guacamole. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. No. Terrell, Should I you, do the honors? you're going to give me the start of it. Okay, so Gordon Ramsay's roasted tomato soup. The first thing Gordon tells us to do, he says, begin by heating olive oil in an oven-safe casserole dish over the stove. Okay, oven-safe casserole dish. Hmm. Now, I've never I don't got one over here. put no. Okay. I've never put no casserole dish on, on the stove. stove. All right, Gordon. Now, Gordon, we're in America. We have different things. Should we heat up all four? I believe it, so. And give it this right here? That, that's, that's a that. big body binge. binge. 
Please don't crash. <laughs> I'm gonna put them all on medium so together they'll make hot. She's placed it diagonal for even distribution on the pan. Yes. Fry your onions and garlic in this heated olive oil, okay? So it doesn't say how much olive oil, so I'm just gonna eyeball it. Do 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 do. That's so satisfying. Was that satisfying? Let's mess it up. Aww. Once this oil gets hot, we're gonna add the onions and the garlic. And then it says, once caramelized, add the tomatoes. Okay, flavor with sea salt to taste, add cayenne pepper. Not sure if that's gonna be for us. We're not cayenne fans. Really? You don't like spice and neither do I. Oh, that's the one that equals actual spice. Yeah. It's not like paprika that's just for show. Correct. <laughs> okay. Cayenne not- is giving Caliente. That's, oh, oh! If it's this, then it's just a dollop, and compared with all these big body tomatoes, it will barely. Would you like to taste just a dollop? Give it an acrylic dollop, and see what it's giving. Oh my ow! <laughs> oh, sorry. I thought I had more room because of this big body bins. You know what I'm excited about? Yeah. I'm excited to see how Mr. Ramsey. Um, gets his flavors are going because I know all of his stuff is just so flavorful. We're gonna follow this to the T, guys. Okay? To the T in Coco. Yeah. Grill that That's shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna take some time because these onions have to cook down and get all nice and soft. So when you're starting to see this color, folks, that means you're getting close, okay? My mom used to have to sneak veggies into all of our meals. Oh, dear. So the the veggie would be like this big, and we'd be like, hey. (laughs) Hey. What's the big idea? Literally. (laughs) Anytime there was like a larger one, we'd be like, oh my god. Wow. It was what crazy. vegetables do you like? I actually do like onions. That don't count. I like zucchines. Okay. I like um, broccoli asparagus. Okay. Um, yeah. Those are all good. Yeah. Okay. That's, a, it's, we gotta add the salt now, right? Your favorite part. Yeah. Flavor with sea salt to taste. To a normal person's taste. Fine. To a normal human being's taste. Yes. One more pinch. Girl, a normal black person's taste. <laughs> give it what it needs to give now. I don't want no Kanye pepper. What if it's just a dollop? I don't believe a dollop is gonna serve us. Sugar. That will serve us. Sugar is right there. Oh, it's so tiny. Smell it, make sure it's sugar. Girl, what sugar smell like? Exactly. You fell right into the trap. Put it in there. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I feel stupid. <laughs> uh huh. Um, balsamic vinegar. Okay, now which one is that? You gotta smell. You have to decide which one's balsamic because I can't stand vinegar. Is this teriyaki or not? Coco! Terrell, we don't have time for this. What? <laughs> fucking hell! <hate you. laughs> Put it in there! I knew there was no teriyaki. <laughs> Roxy stands. <laughs> Our oven is almost ready at 310. It's gonna be 350. And that's gonna go in there for 20 to 25 minutes. And while they bake, begin sun-dried tomato pesto by crushing sun-dried tomatoes in a in a in a mortar. Mortar. That's what that is. Hmm. Did not know the name of that. Oh, we're gonna crush that and that. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. This is looking mighty good. No, it's not. Terrell. No, it Why is. Why would you lie to the people? It is, because all this is going to get crushed down this into the like soup, girl. What, this looks like what witches eat. Gordon, don't pay her no mind. I'm not trying to have Gordon cussing me out on TikTok. What are you, joke? Come that, on. That's, yes. When he put the bread on Shorty's ears, he was like, what are you? I'm an idiot sandwich. In the oven, 2025. I am very excited about this recipe because one of my favorite things to eat as a child was tomato soup and grilled cheese. Really? Yes. I know that was not your your ministry, but for me, it's like an after school special. I wonder, can you guess what my favorite food was as a child? Let's see. Hmm. You've seen my palate, I I have seen your palate. It can be quite elementary, so let's see. My palate is pre-K. I, I, I know. Probably like 
pizza. What? No tomato. You don't eat pizza? I do, but I would never, ever crave it. Wow, okay, well, yeah, that makes sense. But I just thought pizza would be the exception. Come let on, me see. think about it. Okay, let me think about it. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Don't like peanut butter or jelly. You My like God. peanut butter and jelly? Cereal. I like one cereal. <laughs> what? What cereal is it? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Yeah. Fries and Flakes. Yuck. Fruit Loops. Yuck. Kicks. Lucky Charms. Reese's. Pops. Reese's. Oh, that's not even a cereal. It's just a candy that they made a cereal. And, and, and Damn it. Fruit Loops isn't? What was it as a candy? Oh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Oh, I thought about? you were saying that it was like a, just a candy cereal. That's not cereal. You're eating candy. No, I'm saying it's it so was sugary. a candy first. Oh. And they just made it a cereal for capitalism. You are a contradictory okay, fooder. Okay, it's peanut butter flavored. It's not peanut butter. Oh my God. Is it a sandwich? No. What could it possibly, oh, give me a hint. It's two things and they always, you always try to eat, you pretty much always eat them together. They're separate entities, pretty much always on the same plate, though. Hot dogs and french fries. You are close. Is it chicken nuggets? Of course! Oh! The little dinosaur nuggets, man! Come on, man! I was not into chicken nuggets. I was burger and fries, or pizza, or anything soul food. I was not doing chicken fingers, especially when they was in them little shapes. Them little shapes scared me. Boy, please, I would bite that donut. Them little dinosaurs you get from Burger King back in the day, I was like, uh-uh, I don't wanna eat no Tyrannosaurus Rex. You're like a preteen as a child. That's why I'm an elderly <laughs> grandmother <laughs> as a 20-year-old. <laughs> I'm screaming, okay, so let's do the next step. Yes. While the tomatoes are baking, begin sun-dried tomato pesto, crushing the sun-dried tomatoes in the mortar. Ew. <laughs> Ew, please don't touch me, tomato juice. I'll cry inside. Why do you sound like Avril Lavigne right now? <laughs> I've been really giving, he was a skater boy. <laughs> Basically. Literally. I'm gonna give you a challenge as you're crushing these tomatoes in the mortar. Okay. I'm gonna give you an artist and you have to mimic them Okay, do oh. your best impression. Okay. But you can't use their lyrics. Rihanna. Oh no, don't touch me. Tomato pesties. Summer Walker. Um, I don't want this tomato on my freaking skin. If I have to smell tomato, it feel just like sin. Scissor. Why are we keeping this nasty tomato all on my skin? I don't want to see it. No, no, no. <laughs> I don't know. I don't freaking know. Mariah Carey. No! Billie Eilish. Oh, no. I don't want this tomato all up on my fingertips. I just don't want to touch it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> It's gotta be done by now. Seriously, look, but Let like the see. skin isn't giving. I do see what you're saying. Oh, gosh, I'm so happy to be out of that air. <laughs> In a dry pan, we're gonna toast the pine, nut, mm -hmm. pine nuts, toast them to the absolute max. Don't know what max means in this context. Does that mean asphalt? <laughs> or does it mean half asphalt? I'm just gonna say that- Half-assed. How- <laughs> <laughs> However we would want our toast, that's how we should want these pine nuts. They, they're so, they're so Blair not nutty. They're, they're, they're like just... softy a little bit, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I kind of want it to pop like popcorn. They look like maggots. Oh, okay, gross. They do though. I mean. You can't argue with it. Yeah, now that you said it. <laughs> you can't super, argue. Super maggot. Yeah, they're getting a little color on them. Yeah, they are. I'm giving chef right now. You are. Y'all see this, let me flip them. Ramsey, are you watching? Adding our pine nuts. Great Parmesan on top of the pesto. Ooh, now that's giving. I think you should just put it and like hold it on top so it all falls straight in. Oh, oh my yes. gosh, she's so smart. Uh -huh. I just know like to see the cheese go down there. <laughs> 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 I laugh. Are we using all the parm? No, oh, did you say how much? Great Parmesan on top of pesto. It does not say how much. Oh, oh, oh no. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> nom 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 nom. Eat it up. Sorry. Mm. I just can't. Now that's good. Wow. I would eat yeah. that cheese like it was. Now how much did you my put? My job. 
You done put so much damn cheese in here. I'm just trying to. And is it gonna mix? To, is it gonna mix well? Not they said put some olive oil in it. It mixes well. So throw me some olive oil in here so I can get some juices going. Period. Gordon, we gonna make this pesto. After this, we're gonna cover the roasted tomatoes halfway with chicken stock and bring to a boil. Ooh. A minute. Ooh. Yo. That. It look, ooh, that smells good now. It do smell all right. Uh-huh, I'm trying to tell you. Not my mother asking me to cook this later. You know she watches the show and she loves herself some damn tomato soup. Really? Oh, she going. Oh, Not the immediate boil. I'm scared to pour. That's halfway, no? Add cream to the roasted tomatoes. This is the part where this could go very wrong for me. Cream time. All right. Oh, that's about to be good, girl. Not mad. Uh, not mad. The steam was getting a little hot. <laughs> <laughs> Had to step back, catch myself. All right, so add the cream. Uh huh. Mash tomatoes with a wooden spoon for a thicker soup, or blend using a handheld mixer for a smoother soup. Ooh, I think we should use a handheld mixer. Yeah, it needs I definitely to be smoother. do not want to taste these tomatoes. Yeah, it needs to be smoother regardless. Na 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 na, mama, yeah, 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 Oh, the no. spigot. Here we go. I'm gonna give it liquefied. Oh, no! Ow! What happened? It's burning. It's hot. Ow! Oh, no! It hurts! Oh, that's giving red. <laughs> it's giving tomato. Medic! It was on pour. No way. Yes way. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. <laughs> that's tomato soup, look just like it. Are we bringing this back onto the heat now? I don't even know. I'm still thinking about my fingers. Oh, What's that? It's just some dust. Okay. Oh, my okay. hand right now feels like the skin could just peel off at any moment. Okay, this, this is a deeper issue than what you were putting on. Oh, I'm being a troop. Oh, wow. That whole... Did you see my hand firmly planted on that blender? Full of hot, boiling, heavy crank. So we're gonna start a ruse? Sorry! Did you say a rouge? No. <laughs> We're gonna start a rouge. That was it. Start a rouge. Okay. A rouge, rouge, baby. A rouge. The X is salento. Oh, I see, like faux fur. Yes, very much okay. like that. Butter in pan for the root. Ooh. Gosh. Shaft. We're gonna add some flour. Okay. Okay, then we're gonna add stout beer until you get a rich mass. Now, Gordon, what the hell is mass in American? Right. Add a stout beer until you get a rich mass. Maybe that means means weight? Okay, yeah, because mass is size. Yeah, in science, mass yes. equals mc squared. Type of react. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. That's... Keep going, get, the, get in this cut right here. There we go. What? Wow, this is the Worcestershire. Okay. Mix thoroughly and grate cheddar cheese and add to the roux until the cheese melts. Now how much cheese are we supposed to be adding? This looks like Play-Doh. Yuck, man. What, what is that going on? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What? Hot milk. <laughs> you put all that cheese in there now, it's giving dairy. Oh! <laughs> I'm so upset. Terrell, 
It's crazy. You added all that. You smell it. You understand? I get what you're saying. It is. It is giving slight. God. Slight. Dookie. <laughs> That's what it's giving. That ain't going nowhere. That can't be right. That looks horrible. My demise. This is nasty. That is so damn good. Oh my gosh. That is so damn good. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna cut this bread so I can eat this soup because that soup is on fire. It is delicious. Uh-oh. What is that on the stove? My hair! Oh, shit! Oh, I, it do smell like got to be. That smells like burnt got to be. Not Coco setting her whole hair on fire, me setting my whole hand, hand on, on fire. fire. I knew being around you was gonna be <laughs> hellish. <sighs> This is never gonna cut. Okay, I'm gonna make two slices of this, and that's it. Yeah, this Look is great. Look at that with all the holes in it. I know, what is that, what is that gonna hold? Exactly. But also, this thick one here, I can see all your face. Hello. Hi. It's like that Instagram filter. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Yes. Cut bread and toast in oven on both sides so the bread becomes golden and crispy. Then spread the cheesy mixture over the top of the bread. And then grate the cheese on top and add some Worcestershire sauce. And that's it. Bread is in the oven. Put this on that, right? Wait a minute. You're not gonna pile all of that on there. Just give it a, a, a decent, like, like if it was jelly. And then you put cheese on that, right? Oh yeah. Okay. Now this is finna give cheddar. Oh, uh, and then they said only put it in for another 90 seconds. So this should be quick. I'm going to pour. Do you see how piping hot this is yet still. and still? That's sickening. Yet and still. I can't, okay. So we're gonna hit it up like that right there. Boom. Yeah. Shut it. Pour me some porridge, please, okay. sir. Okay, you're welcome. There we go. Thank you. And then all you do is you take some of this pesto, take some of this pesto and just drop her on top. And you got a tomato soup. Okay, elevation style. Toast is ready. Bring out the toast. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm just gonna take this up with my hands. No, have you not learned? <laughs> I haven't learned anything. <laughs> Is she to burn, mama? <laughs> I am proud of how this came out so far. The look of it is cool. I wish the cheese was like more like Domino's cheesy bread. You know how it's like really saturated mm -hmm. and really pull you away. Mm -hmm. But rubber band style. Yes. Why is that bread hitting? Uh, what the hell? <laughs> that shit is great. <laughs> Hold on, oh, Gordon. Whoa. whoa. Wait. Wait, let me whoa. come over here. I don't want to reach too far over this stove. <laughs> I'm traumatized. Wait. Okay, first of all, let me get this with the, the pesto. Did we succeed at something? Did we succeed at a Gordon Ramsay meal? <laughs> Listen to the sound here in my gut. Mmm. I had to burn my other hand for this meal. Wow. Wow. Please come taste this. Is it that good? It's actually really, Terrell, we're really becoming chefs. Like seriously. Are we, we're really doing no, it. No, it's not even funny anymore. Taste your soup. It's honestly very good. I've been eating the soup and you know I don't like tomatoes. Yes. You don't like tomatoes, but oh, that wow. is fire. Wow. Yes. That is Michelin star rated soup. About time. About time. Okay. Wow. About time. Okay. About time. Okay. Real Ew. chefs. It's cool. Real chefs. I'm trying to Real tell y'all. Wow, We're professional Real amateurs. Chefs. Wow. The Isn't pesto. The, the pesto. pesto. You don't even Whoa. like tomatoes. That's I don't so even exciting. like tomatoes. Yes. Who am I? That's so exciting. Wow. 
I, I am a little excited. Uh, my palate has been opened. The crew's gonna come and eat this delicious meal we prepared. And we will see y'all in the future episode. Period. Um, in which I'm gonna gain five pounds eating all that soup. Oh, and that oh, blender. Oh. Mm -hmm. Let's make some more bread. Mm-hmm, yes. Mm. Oh. And you was looking at me all crazy for the thick toast. I wish it was thinner, I will say. Oh. <laughs>